So I'm really curious how anybody can get paid off of lying about their height. The only thing I can think is maybe uh, sponsors or something. I'm guessing. That's the only thing I can think because if they lie about their height and people are watching their stuff and then they're like selling stuff because they're asking these people like, yo, I got all these people watching me because they think I'm eight foot tall for some reason. But I mean, I don't know. I'm about to see how, how they uh, make money, I guess. Because damn, if all I got to do is put a camera at an angle and be like, yeah, dude, I'm eight foot tall. Pay me money. Yeah, why isn't everybody doing that? This is the extremely tall family of TikTok star Marie Tamara. Their heights are 7 foot 5, 7 foot 9, 6 foot 3, 7 foot 10, and 7 foot flat. Only these numbers are a complete and utter lie. None of them are actually this tall That's a and everybody has fucking begun to deep notice person. it. Let me show you how. Marie began on social media by detailing her life as a very tall woman. She posted videos such as this one talking about the struggles of finding dresses which fit before concluding with a self-confident message showing that she was comfortable in her own Hold skin. Up. She does look tall as shit though that's the top of a door oh hell no that woman would pick me up and put me in a high chair bro in other videos marie joked about dancing with the short king because he's the only one at the club not in two she could literally rest her arm on top of the on top of the fridge maybe it is the angle that they're doing are they are they hitting the uh lord of the rings angles you know how they made it look like Gandalf was huge compared to all the hobbits? Intimidated by her height, so exactly how tall was she? Well, considering she could hold her feet above doorways and refrigerators, it seems she was close to seven feet. However, she'd reveal in a different video that she was actually six foot one. Marie then restated that she was- Bro, he was like- he was cool with it. Video that she was actually six foot one. Marie then restated that she was six foot one in a different TikTok video. However, only one day after claiming this, she'd post a new video in which it appeared she'd grown another inch. Wait, you're six foot two now. Did you grow? Yet the likelihood the that she'd had some unexpected overnight growth spurt was low, given she was already twenty seven at the time. Doesn't even make sense the video. though, does it? What seemed more likely was that Marie's height was being embellished to make her situation mm. seem more interesting. With the sudden change instantly reducing how much the audience trusted her. What is your actual height? Each of your TikToks seemed to say something different. Yet Marie stood strong with her previous claim in an article reading, I'm six foot two and dating is almost impossible. I'm tired of being called a man. Some clarity was then man. provided when Marie introduced her even taller six foot five mother to the videos. Although what Marie failed to disclose was that her mother is a little more famous than the audience might have realized. In Damn, a previous a basketball video, player? Been Holy mentioned shit. That the was a former professional basketball player and Therefore, by googling her he name, Christine Tamara, it's not difficult to find a bunch of public information. There's an article from April 2016 explaining that she played university basketball in 1981, which exposed another lie that the mother was a WNBA player, considering the WNBA wasn't even founded until 15 years later in 1996. Although right. in possibly the first truth told on Murray Tamara's channel, the article confirmed that the mother was in fact six foot five. Yet it'd be pretty dumb this to was already about sleeping? this considering its public record. What Marie failed to realize is that there are also public sporting records confirming her height, but we'll get to that later. With the videos between Marie and her mother going viral, the rest of the family was then introduced as the tallest family on TikTok, where Marie established her Damn. brother Shane at six foot nine, her second brother Troy at six foot 10, and her father Mike at six foot three. Well, that's assuming they were all telling. Uh, yeah, how are they lying about it though? And I mean, this just has to be the angle, right? Because obviously he's way closer to the camera than her. She's 6'5". 6'2 in the front. 6'3". <laughs> Damn, dude. I, I could probably believe her. I mean, obviously she's a basketball player, right? So there's record of her. Why would they lie, though? Like, what are their heights? For real, for real. Troy at six foot ten, and her father Mike at six foot three. Well, that's assuming they were all telling the Is truth. Is it just the, the numbers the family that they're lying about? Gaining over four million views, incentivizing them to continue making content. They do a bunch of unique videos like showing their shoe sizes and talking about their weight at birth. Yet it was their "How tall are the kids?" and the "Things we make look small" videos which performed the best, gaining over twenty million views each. The family then made a dedicated Instagram called Team Tamara before Marie, Shane, and even Team the mother. Tamara. Again, doing paid content with Marie. Well, I mean, okay, if she's if she's six five, 
It said it said he was what six three, right? He's six nine. He's six ten. Or eleven. He's six two. How the hell is six two? She's taller than six three. And then he's six five. Are my eyeballs playing tricks on me? Doing paid content. I don't see how, I don't see why they would lie about it though. Like, are they just lying about the numbers? Is that it? They're just giving the wrong numbers? With Marie stating in a WFAN interview that she made more than six figures in her very first month. This Dude. was then followed by a New York Post article two months later reading, Tamara says she now rakes in an average of $189,000 per Damn. month and once banked $295,000 for what? In Just a single doing shit period. being while this she's gave tall? the family a very strong incentive to not only keep going, but to perhaps embellish their height even further. Although since they'd already... Wait, so people... Are paying them to do this just because they're tall is that what you're telling me period this guy the f people are paying the tall people do this family of in a random very strong incentive to not only keep going, but to perhaps embellish their height even further. Although since they'd already posted multiple videos, each claiming that Marie was the shortest at six foot two and Troy was the tallest at six foot ten, it felt as though the truth had finally been established. Until all of a sudden, Marie had grown another inch and was now six foot three. Dude, I swear I can't with this stuff. At first you're six one, then six two, and now you're six three. Come on now, weren't you six two a couple of weeks? Why are you guys? Keeping such hard track on her, though. What the fuck you care for, though? I mean, unless she's the one that keeps coming out saying, like, I'm 6'2", I'm 6'2", and you're following her, and, like, the, you, obviously, it's like, okay, we get it, bro, you're 6'2". And then, wait, what the fuck? Who's suffocating? Oh, shit. Get up there, fool. Oh, she's dead as fuck. Oh, there she goes. Holy shit, bro. What the fuck? Yeah, I don't know why people are keeping such hard track on her, though. Unless, like like I said, unless they, she's, like, bragging about it and they can't get away from it. And then now she's bragging a new number and they're like, wait, weren't you fucking 6'3 last week? Now you're 8'9? What the hell's going on here? ago can we get a six foot three measurement to prove although the family was offering no such video instead marie continued to claim that she was now six foot three with the trend so far already hinting at what was about to happen instead marie skipped seven whole inches to make the claim that she was now six foot ten at which what? point the audience simply did wait what she jumped from saying six three now to six ten out what was about to happen. Instead, Marie skipped seven whole inches to make the claim that she was now six foot ten, at which point the audience simply didn't know what was true. Six two or six three or six ten, what? Six ten, six three, what's the real height? OMG, bro, you change your height in every video. First six three, then six two, now six for it, ten. Though? Yet the backlash against or her watching it, who gives it? Well, no I mean, she is still big. Account, and if anything, continuing to lie She's still only big girl. boosted the family's presence further. Three months after claiming that she'd magically gone from 6'2 to 6'10, Marie and the family had their best month ever gaining over 400,000 TikTok followers and it was only after her unexplained 6'10 growth spurt that Marie began to see any growth over on YouTube. On top of this, Marie would post a TikTok stating that the family was now making $800,000 per month, leading her to buy a $245,000 Aston uh. Martin, although she'd then state that she was apparently too big to fit inside it, which was a shame given she and the family, as unbelievable as it might sound, we're about to get even taller. On the 14th of April 2023, Marie Tamara uploaded a TikTok now claiming to be seven foot tall. What's this? That's for Pepper. You keep dog food in your fridge? It's not dog food, it's fresh pet. Real meat, real veggies. It's what? dog food. I'm gonna have to get my dog some of that. You were so right about her. Yeah. <laughs> Reinventing our network for total confidence. I love advertisements. Fast, Incredible. Reliable. Perfectly orchestrated. The United States Postal Service. Bro, she started at 6'1", now she's 7 feet, bro. However, in order to make it believable, she'd also need to scale up everybody else in the family. So her brother Troy became 7'7". Seven seven. I was her about to say, hold up. Is she jumped? Damn. She really gonna claim that now. 
Motherfucker, eight foot tall. And what? Let me guess. She jumped from six five to seven two. The brother Shane became seven foot five, while the mother became seven foot two. The only person wow. whose height hadn't changed was the dad, who stayed put at six foot three. Yet Wait, what? Wait, so now she's just making this different claims? Like now she's just saying that, or she's saying, yeah, we're growing, but he's saying the same. How people can't have mobility. Tall. Bro, she started at 6'1, now she's 7 feet, bro. However, in order to make it believable, she'd oh also need so a she's just lying about it. Family. So her brother Troy became 7'7, seven seven. her other brother Shane became 7'. Why though? All they have to do is look up the mom, right? If, she, if the mom was a basketball player? All they'd have to do is look up the mom, see her height, mm. and be like, yo, you're obviously lying. And then stop watching the fucking show. Like, why do you need to watch it? I oh, won't get it foot five while the mother became seven foot two the only person whose height hadn't changed was the dad who stayed put at six foot three yet this was only a plot to get more views but we'll explain that in just a second in the meantime marie gained over 50 million views on one single tiktok stating i'm not that tall when i'm with my mom Damn. in which the mother's height had been embellished yet again from seven foot two to hold on let me see that height difference Damn, dude. She got a duck when she walks in the door. That's crazy. Been embellished yet again from seven foot million two views, to seven though? That's five. crazy. In the next video, the mother that, like grown another bucks? inch to seven foot six. Yet at this point, someone in the comments pointed out a fatal flaw in the family story. What? Nah, that's crazy because the Guinness World Record holder for the tallest woman is 215 centimeters, and it's a very good point. At a height of 229 centimeters or seven foot six, Marie Tamara's mum would be the second tallest woman currently alive, the second. second tallest woman in American history, and the eleventh tallest woman ever recorded yet she's nowhere 11th tallest so there's been taller well that's just woman what the fuck how tall is the tallest man ever recorded yet she's nowhere to be seen on wikipedia's list of tallest people on top of this if marie tomorrow is the tallest was human really being foot, on earth she should also be on this list right next to seven foot all. Jana Semjanova, like, even in caveman again, times greek times and shit seen. When called out for the lie in a comment reading, Bro, you are not seven foot, you are six foot two, Marie responded by pulling out a tape measure to some arbitrary length before holding it up against her shoulder and claiming that it was six foot two long. She then doubled down in the comment Why would she not show by it? stating, If I was six two, would I be able to grab the fan so easily? Yet she'd then get destroyed in the replies by someone who simply wrote, I'm six two and have <laughs> no problem doing it. The only evidence Marie had to prove that she was actually seven foot was that she stood about a head taller than her dad. However, even Eesh. this was a lie, as Marie had simply gotten sneakier with it's her camera tall, angles. Bro. In videos such as this one, where the brothers had grown yet again to seven foot nine and seven foot ten, the dad is standing at the back while the bottom of the frame is cut off at the feet, where it's obvious Marie is wearing heels and is possibly even standing on something. When your ankles are mid calf on the person mm -hmm. next to you, hmm. The only time Marie showed herself standing on flat ground was in the videos where her father isn't present. Although as highlighted by this comment reading, she's standing in front of the door and the camera is low. It's an illusion to make them taller. There are even more tricks at play here. For example, in this video, Marie claimed that she couldn't Damn, fit inside dude. the shower. Yet That's fucking crazy though. <laughs> she's probably like in some Barbie house or some doll house or some shit. Or like a small hotel room or something. But damn, that would that would make me feel like a giant, man. That's crazy. Her ankles are almost as high as the on-off tab, while in this video, it's obvious that she's simply standing on the edge of the bath, and she's not the only person in the family using this trick. Over on Shane's personal Instagram, his 7 foot 5 inch height places him head and shoulders above a door frame, yet the camera cuts ah, off damn. well above his knees, and this isn't even the worst part. In a pin Do you realize how low he's, he's fucking got a limbo under doors every time he walks through? Like, homie literally got to crouch and crawl through a doorway. I mean, obviously, it's he's not that tall, but that would, that's, that would be what he would have to do if that was, like, true. The worst part. In a pinned post, Shane has his basketball stats listed, in which it confirms that he's 2 meters and 6 centimeters, or 6 foot 9 inches, and he's not the only person in the family to have their sporting records online. Troy, apparently the tallest in the family, seems as though he's just going with the flow of the family's antics. However, that's not to say his displayed height is accurate. In a George Mason University basketball profile, Troy's height is listed not as 7 foot 10, but rather as 6 foot 8. Why did, why did, basketball webs 
So basically, they were being truthful at first, and then for some reason, they decided to exaggerate it by 10 inches. And people, instead, if people are spending all their time engaging with it, and which is getting them paid for some reason. Or maybe some people are dumb enough to believe, like, hey, that's crazy that this lady is fucking nine foot three. How are they making millions, though? Just because they're getting millions of views, isn't TikTok like pennies to the fucking millions of views? I don't get it, bro. How are they making so much money? Like I said, it's got to be sponsors, maybe. Maybe uh, donations on live views from people that are dumb enough to believe them or are just like dumb enough to give them their money to be like, you're such a liar. Here's $500. Prove it. Sites list his height at six foot nine, meaning that he's not only the same height as the other brother, but he's at least one foot one inch shorter than what's being shown on TikTok. Meanwhile, Shane's apparent height of seven foot nine is a foot taller than his actual height, while the mother's TikTok height of seven foot five is also a full foot taller than her actual height. But what about Marie, the mastermind of the whole operation, whose social media presence is so untruthful, she even lies about what kind of men she's into just to make more money, stating that she she's attracted to five foot nine short kings while simultaneously yeah, she might be that you don't know that my height is almost impossible as it is extremely difficult to find a guy taller than me oh. well, according to an old cross country but well, that doesn't mean that that's your only preference you know like i'm sure she'd be willing to try it then again i don't know like for her if she's she's what six two for real, for real five nine ain't even that much short i mean it is way shorter but at the same time i don't know like yeah I'm sure there are a lot of guys over over 6'2", man. Running profile, she's not 7 foot, not 6 foot 10, not 6 foot 3, or even 6 foot 2. She's rather 6 feet and 1 inch tall, as was oh. stated in her first few videos. Yeah, but don't... Do people not grow at all after a certain point? Like, do they just 100% stop? Or do they slowly, maybe tightly, slightly, slightly grow a little bit? And then maybe she, like, goes and gets herself... uh. Well, I mean, obviously not, but <laughs> I was going to say she could like go get herself checked every now and then. And then whenever she hits the 6.15, she could be like, oh, I'm 6'2", rounding up, 6'2". The only person whose height hasn't been lied about at any point is the dads at six foot three. Yet again, this was only done to make the others seem taller. But I guess posting a real family photo like this one without- Damn, look at how different- Wow. So this is 6'5", yeah, 6'3", and then 6'1". Damn, he's short. No, I'm kidding. Uh, damn. Yeah, that ain't that big a difference. It's crazy how much a camera angle can play into that. Like I said, man, the whole Lord of the Rings thing, it wasn't even CGI. It was the camera angles. When when uh, Gandalf is like walking around in the Hobbit home, he's like small as fuck, you know? Or he's big as fuck camera angles just wouldn't receive the same kind of exposure. Despite this, the family continue to claim that they're a group of seven foot tall giants, earning millions of views and dollars by doing so, while irritating the entire world in the process. Fuck it, dude. They're the ones paying for it. You know, who gives a shit? <laughs> they don't need to be paying for it. They don't need to be engaging in it. Uh, and I mean, if you're gullible enough to fall for it, sorry, but gotta make that bag somehow. People are dumb enough to pay for cigarettes and alcohol and shit, like straight up literal poison. I think it's okay to pay for uh, imagination and for, I don't know, fucking, it helped. They feel it. They, they want to believe it. Let them believe it and let them pay them for it. Fuck it. I don't think that's a big deal though. I don't see why she's lying about it. I mean, obviously you'll get more clicks if people are like, you're seven foot. Nah, 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 nah. And then the angles that they are playing, like, I mean, come on. At least they're putting effort into trying to look like it, you know? That's more effort than other people do, <laughs> I guess. So, I don't know. Hate the hustle, but... I hate the, hate the game, don't hate the player.